Hi, my name is Sean Williams. I'm a South Carolina native. I studied art at the College of Charleston. I'm currently employed as a metal worker, creating sculptural and architectural ironwork. I also do a variety of commission painting and art projects like murals, signs, portraits, um, all different things. I do prefer working on a large scale. The bigger the better. It seems to have a stronger impact and I like my art uh, displayed publicly. I am uh, doing Bacchanal, which is derived from uh, the festival of Bacchus, the classical god of uh, wine, drinking. Um, it's definitely just full of energy. Um, a kind of frenzied, um, lots of movement. Um, I saw red instantly stood out for me as a main color. I wanted to incorporate a lot of motion into it because it's, you know, it, it goes from one extreme to the other. The painting has a lot of figures kind of spinning around together in a, a general motion. It's more about the power, yes. Right. Power, um, because the music is powerful, so we wanted to show more of the power, power of that high priest, power of the music, and power over the masses. The, even though it's a little bit about sacrificing and, and worshipping, we aren't sacrificing or worshipping any dancers in the making of this piece. No, we're not. Okay, good. No dancers were hard in the making of this That's piece. That's right. I uh, was to paint um, kind of mystically, you know, figures receding and protruding out. Um, depth is kind of ambiguous. I have that, all the figures are mixed in kind of an ambiguous space, but um, all together and, you know, unified with each other. Um, I mostly so paint abstracted figures, portraits, and weave themes of nature, evolution, mysticism, spirituality, and I uh, like to add elements of comedy, um, the absurd. Improvisation is very important in my work. Uh, a lot of my paintings begin abstractly and then develop into realistic images which are pulled out of these abstractions. My painting process follows somewhat of a call and response format. Uh, I spend the majority of the time actually looking and observing the painting and allowing it to develop a life of its own and take its own form. And it's the mysteriousness of the painting that intrigues me, you know, where is it going? The, uh, the endless possibilities um, drawn from subconscious, um, it's, a, it's a puzzle, it's a personal exploration, finding out about yourself, who you are, and it's really the curiosity of what I'll create next or in the future and where how my art is progressing that really drives me to continue this endeavor.